Hello guys, this is Video Tech Dude, and today I'm going to show you how to upload a video, edit it, and add music to it, and do some other stuff. So what you're going to do first is you want to make sure you have a Google or a YouTube account. If you just have a Google account, then you can just sign into YouTube with your Google information, and it will say, like, enter in your YouTube name and everything, and then just go through that. And once you do that, you want to push this awesome YouTube button right here. So you push that, and it brings you to this page. Now what you do with this page is you can click right here like this, and it will pop up a little window like this where you can choose your file off your desktop. Or what you can do is you can find your video which I'm just going to be using this little video and you can drag it onto here and just unclick and then what you want to do this uploaded really fast because it's only like two seconds and it's already done uploading um, but what you want to do is you want to go to the privacy settings and public means anybody can see it even if they don't have a YouTube channel and unlisted means you can send them the link to the video but nobody else can see it private means nobody can see it except for you um, I'm gonna make this private actually I'm gonna make it unlisted for now actually I'm gonna make it public for now so oh. so you can get all your options so right here you have check boxes for Twitter Facebook and Google Plus if you click one of them it will pop up the sign-in for the social media website and you can just sign in once you signed in it will stay like that and you can just click it and then right here you can enter in your message um, and that will be posted on whatever um, media site you choose with that message um, and then your category is what category it goes in so check one of them fitting your video or not um, this is your title this is what the you want to name this what your video is about um, and what you want people to search for the description um, when people search for videos it can look for keywords in the description so you usually want to make the description pretty big tags are the important words um, that kind of like the description but if somebody searches for one of these your video will pop up somewhere on the list um, and then it gives you suggested tags which you can just like add I have custom tags, uh, auto tags filled in there. And then with your video thumbnail, you can just click one of these. They're all the same to me. <laughs> um, or you can choose a custom thumbnail. If you don't have this button, then, um, then you have to apply, like, say, I want custom thumbnails in your account settings. Um, if you don't know where that is, then just leave me a comment and I might make a video on it. Um, so yeah, video thumbnails. And then once you're done, you can save changes. It automatically saves most of the time. And then, oh, and also you cannot upload longer than 15 minute videos unless you um, like apply for that under account settings. Um, but I can, I can do that because I already did that, but you need a cell phone number to apply for the longer than 15 minute videos because, yeah, but I don't think they send any trash to your cell phone because I did it and I didn't get any trash. So that's good. Um, then once your video is done uploading, you can go to your video manager. I'll make this full screen. Come on, in. 
internet. Here we go. And you can see all my uploads. And then there's pages of that. And this is the video I just um, uploaded. And if I wanted to send this link to somebody, what I would do is I would click on the video. And I would pause it. Let's test video. Let's see, is it HD? It is. Ta-da. Um, and then you would select this right here. Actually, you don't need to select that. You can go down, down here to share. And then you can just do control C or right click and copy. And then you can also just do email. If you have a Gmail, you can just enter in your person's email that you want to send it to and then like the message and then your message preview and then you just send and it's as easy as that I'm just gonna send it to myself right there note send email and oh my gosh it is so easy I just learned that you could do that or you can, if you want to post it on a social media site that's not already posted here, you can highlight it, copy it, and wherever you post it, you just do right click, paste, and there we go. You got your link. And if you have your video set on unlisted, people can still um, view the video, but if you have it on private, they can't see the video. Now, what if we wanted to add a music track to this wonderful video? What we would do is we would go down to audio, we would click on it. And now what we got here, it's only seven seconds long. Um, what we got here is featured tracks. You can sort by top tracks and then different um, music genres, genres. Uh, let's say I just want an electronic one. Feels so good. And then we got music under here. And if we want, if this video that I have right here has audio, we can move the slider down so we can do favor original audio. But it will still have this is a recording uh, of music, but it kind of still overwrites the original audio. Um, so it's not that good, but you can um, start this at a certain point in time just by dragging this. This is a recording of my screen. Here, so if you want to start at one second, we would drag it there. This is a recording. And end it at six seconds. But if we only want a one second long so This is like a that. recording of And that's how you would do audio. And we'll just do revert to original since I don't want to save my changes. Okay, so let's say we want to edit this wonderful video that we just made. Um, I think you can go to enhancements. Maybe not. No. Yeah. This well, this is, is a one way to do it. You can trim your video right here make it start at a certain point and end at a certain point and once you change made changes to your video just push done to apply that and it'll make this it shorter this is a recording of this is um a recording. if you want to add like a special color to it you can just click on one of these or if your video is pretty shaky you can click stabilize and it should fix that up a little bit um now Let's say you want to add different videos to it or like do everything I just showed you in one step. You would push the upload button, you push video editor, you push edit. And this is a little thing I was playing around with. Exit. Um so you can you have your all your videos. I'm just gonna drag down my test video down here and it shows up here you can 
click split and that splits the video in two parts I've been wanting them to add that feature in for a while so you can move this to a different part in the video um, you can adjust by clicking on one of the clips you can adjust all the pan and zoom the black and white the stabilize all the stuff all that good stuff and filters and text text and push enable text and enter in your text right here and you have your text right there so we're good with that um, okay so if you want to add in a different video that's not one of yours go to the CC creative common videos these are videos you can use without like giving credit I'm pretty sure so you can drag down the thing and here we have red flowers in our video now play it out or this is just a clip and this is this just looks like bad quality but once you've uh, published it it should be all good um, unless the clip you chose was bad quality but I don't think it should be bad quality and to exit out of um, this view right here just click over onto the side and you can add photos to your project push this button and then you can go to like upload photos and then you can drag photos into here and you're good with that music I kind of showed you that just click on it drag it uh, whoops okay um, transitions this can be used like in between videos like here and here so we got a crossfade going here and drag our cursor over to the point where we want to preview and we got a crossfade that was really quick um, a recording of my screen and we got a very nice crossfade going on there and now yeah that's pretty much it with the video editor you can push publish and okay and I would suggest clicking info and settings and then changing everything up here I, I want this to be private because I don't want anybody to see it um, push save changes and we're good with that if you want to if you have a webcam on your computer you can push record and push allow and close and there I am yeah so then you can push start recording I can be like this is a recording test and I do not have the best built-in webcam ever but whatever whatever so yeah stop recording upload as easy as that there we go then just enter in everything I told you about before I'm gonna make this video private again save changes and if you want to delete one of your videos that you uploaded, you can click on this arrow, go to Video Manager, and then click on the video you or videos that you want to delete. Go Actions, Delete. What will say? Are you sure you want to delete two videos? Yes, delete. And videos deleted as easy as that. So I hope you like this video and please share it and like it and please don't dislike it and i hope this has helped you in your world of video making and editing editing and i suggest you subscribe and watch more tutorials on youtube because it makes you smarter
So please subscribe and hope you have a great day. Bye.